Good morning, guys. I hope you're all having a wonderful day. So this morning, I'm starting my day out with some coffee and some pumpkin spice creamer. I'm going to make some breakfast sandwiches this morning with some thick cut bacon, some cream cheese, fried eggs, and some little mini bagels. So I'm going to get that going, and then we are going to get on with our day. I know I have some mail coming from Target. I also have some books coming in the mail today. Okay, so the first part of our mail just came when I sat down to eat my bagel. I'm super excited about these new fun schooling journals. We're going to keep a few. We're going to give a few to some friends. And we are just absolutely going to enjoy these because my kids love being in the kitchen. And these have all kinds of stuff they cover. Not just cooking, math, research, nutrition, meal planning, and lots of fun recipes, cooking challenges. My kids love the show Chopped, and there's lots of challenges like that in there where you have to have four ingredient meals and things like that. So we are gonna dive into that very soon. Good morning, guys. It is Thursday morning. It is going to be our first day back to school. It's actually late morning, almost lunchtime. Um, we have been doing some housework and cleanup and chores and taking care of animals because it's cold and rainy and wanna make sure everybody's got plenty of hay and all that jazz. And so, um, we are going to start school here after a little bit and do just um, a little bit of school after lunchtime. I'm at the moment headed over to a local store to us called Anthony's and um, I'm just going to pick up a couple things for dinner. The kids are wanting to do sloppy joes and you can probably hear me a lot better now because I'm past my ridiculously bad road. <laughs> Anyways. The kids want to do sloppy joes for dinner, so I'm going to go pick up a couple of things I need for that and get home. And I think we're going to do a little bit of work and then make a pizza because we ate breakfast late. And then eat pizza and then finish school. I also have a friend who's coming over that wants me to help her dye her hair. Um, I don't recommend you asking me to dye your hair. I told her I didn't have a lot of faith in myself, but she said she does have faith in me. So that's kind of where that stands. And I guess we're going to do that today too. Um, anyways, I'm just, like I said, headed to Anthony's. So um, I'll talk to you guys in a little bit. Okay, guys, I am just pulling in my driveway. Um, I went to Anthony's. I went ahead and went to the dollar store, grabbed a couple things I needed for the house. And while I was there, I picked up a couple of things for Penny's birthday. Her birthday's not till February, but um, post Christmas things are marked down. And so um, I got her just a few things. I'll show you later tonight when I bring them in the house, um, when I got her before I put them up, but I can't show you right now because you'll see. But um, yeah, anyways, I'm gonna get the food inside. I'm gonna leave her stuff out here, get lunch going and start reading and then eat lunch and then our friend should be here and I'm going to do her hair and then we'll finish school. So I think as long as things work out right, that's where we're at. 
Okay, so this is the way lunch is working out. I've got a um, four meat pizza and some blueberry rolls with icing that I'm going to throw in the oven, and that's going to be our lunch. Thursday. So you get five, wait, Bubba, five minus four. So X out four of them. Uh, Go ahead and put X's on them. Move it to and get out my shell. So how many is left? One. Good job. Pomegranate face. What do I do now? Because now what Feelings, plans, and thoughts. Copy a quote or a verse. Draw a picture of your feelings and a to-do list. Okay, so our blueberry rolls are out of the oven and iced. I've got our pizza out and got it sliced up, and I'm going to go ahead and start making plates for the kids um, to go with their pizza and rolls. They wanted to go have it, go ahead and have some of the pepperoni, salami, and prosciutto wrapped cheese, so they're having those and dipping their pizza in ranch. Even the hats are showing cheese. Yep. They go like Now go down. When you go down, it should just like this, and the house goes down. Oh, this is, oh no, that's soft though. <laughs> Do you love it? Rock and roll, yeah. <laughs> Are you a goober? Yeah. Who's your favorite band? And Bob Seger. Well, he's not a band. Never mind. He's DC. <laughs> Okay, so I ordered all of the kids a new t-shirt and then socks and underwear from Target. It all came. They were trying on their new shirts. And now I am going to make some sloppy joes, clean up some after school mess because they did school clear until my friend got here and we just dyed her hair and she's waiting on it to be ready to rinse while I make the sloppy joe meat. I'm just doing about two and a half pounds of ground beef, draining it and adding some thick and chunky sloppy joe sauce to this and just that easy. I'm not making them from scratch tonight. And then of course I air fried the tots and I chopped up some strawberries. I washed and did a pound of them. And then these are gonna go out to the bunnies for a bedtime snack. Here is how the plates worked out. This is Miss Maddie's plate, so she has less than everybody would normally eat. But anyways, here are our sloppy joes and this is my plate and i'm going to end this video here so i hope you enjoyed it and i'll see you guys next time bye